Just wanted to talk to you today about how you can gain access to some of the books in the Q3 Academy Langley Book Cupboard, some that I've been working hard on over the past few weeks just to give you access to some of the reading books that we have. So I'll just talk you through the process. Um, so firstly, the books that are available can be found on the Q3 Academy Langley website. So when you go to the website, and I'll just open it here, when you go to the Q3 Academy Langley website, you need to go to the Students tab here, and you'll see this here, which says Student Library. When you click on that, it will take you to a list of books that are available. Now, not all of the books that were in the book cupboard are available. There are a select, I've selected um, quite a few books, um, and I've tried to make sure that if it is a book series, that we've got all of the books. So, for example, the, the Harry Potter series isn't available because, unfortunately, uh, we are missing one or two of the books at the moment. So that is why some books that you may want to be able to have access to, you may not be able to get, unfortunately. So if you open this list here, uh, the title of the document is COVID book list. You can see that there is a list of all of the books that are available for you to be able to take out from the library. Um, and the book list is organized in uh, you've got your author, you've got the book title. If the book title has a number next to it, that's what number it is in the series. And then you've got the book level of the ZPD level. So the ZPD level is the level of the book, sort of how hard the book will be to read. And so, for example, if you've got a higher reading gauge, then your the ZPD level of the book uh, or the books that you will be able to sort of read are going to be higher. Um, and so it depends on your reading age uh, level. So if you go to your accelerated reading account, you should be able to find your ZPD level there. If you're unable to find that, let me know and I can help you out with that. So once you've selected the book that you want, what you need to do is send an email to the Langley Library email account. OK, so once you've found the book, send an email to this email address here, and that is library at q3langley.org.uk. Um, as it says on there, it's really important that when you send your request, you send it from your Langley student email address. Otherwise, I won't be able to respond to you and you might miss the opportunity to get your book. The email itself should contain the name of the book, the author, your name and your tutor group. And as it says on here, the emails need to be sent by one o'clock on a Thursday for me to be able to get the book ready for you. Uh, once you've sent an email over to me at this um, email address here, I will respond and let you know if the book's available. If the book that you've chosen isn't available, I will let you know. I can make a recommendation. Or if you want to select a different book, obviously, you can do that as well. Once you've requested your book and I've responded, uh, you'll be able to get the book in one of two ways. So I will leave the book at the Academy for you. I will put it in an envelope and write your name and the book title on the front of it. And this way, then when you come to collect the book, the envelope can just be given to you. Uh, as it says on here, you can come and collect the book from the admin team in the foyer of the Academy. Books must be collected on a Friday or a Monday. When you arrive at the Academy, obviously you have to press the button to let the, the admin team know who it is that's coming in. Just let them know that you're here to collect a book and also your name and tutor group. If you're unable to uh, get to the Academy, the book can be delivered to your address by Mr. Fulgence. As it says here, this should only be the case if you do not have access or unable to get to the Academy. If this is the case, let me know when you're requesting your book and I'll be able to organize that for you. As it says down here, once you have your book, you can't quite see what it says at the bottom there. But once you have your book, you have three weeks to finish it before you'll be asked to return the book. When it comes to returning the books, uh, there is a process for this as well. So once you finish your book, send an email to myself to let me know. And then this means that I will be able to open that book up to other students that may want to read it. Books are to be dropped back to the academy and they will go in a book return box. So in the foyer, there will be a box where you can return books. Um, so you don't have to have any contact with anybody from... Uh, from the Academy administration team just to keep everything safe. So you will drop the book in the box. Um, and then at the end of the day, this box will be taken. Uh, the books will be quarantined for a minimum of 72 hours in a separate room from the other books. The book return box will be cleaned every day. And once this period of quarantine is over, once the three days in which the books are quarantined is over, other students that want access to that book or other students that want to read that book will be able to request that book, okay? Uh, and that's everything, really. If you have any questions, obviously, you can email me on my um, Langley email account or the library um, account. And that email address is just here. So library at q3langley.org.uk. Thanks very much.